This is a avial muff. Looks like somebody doesn't want to be followed. But you're not getting rid of me that easily. I am like herpes. A cool version of herpes. Here, fishy, 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 fishy. Huh, it doesn't even seem to see them. Here, fishy, 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 fishy. Huh, it doesn't even seem to see them. Well, I guess the eye has to die. Here, fish. Huh, must be on a. Not a ch. I'll hang on to it till my. Okay, let's give it my bad. It was the cotton candy that was phosphorus. Not a chance. I'll hang on to it. This is a spoked bevel? That's bright enough. Machine. I hate gadgets that only do what they were designed for. Phosphorus anchovies. A Rufus God collaboration. Huh? I feel hungry again. Eat. That's strange. My subconscious should be asleep at this time of day. Something smells rotten. Damn, he's on to us. Let's get out of here. Let there be light. Here, fishy, 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 fishy. Here I am, behind the cracked window. <laughs> Stupid animal. Ah, locked. Distrustful bunch, these pirates. Harmless Trawler, the perfect disguise for pirates and slave traders. Well, who do we have here? Ah, Welcome to Bozo's Trash Trawler. I'm Bozo. Don't shoot! I'm unarmed! What? I don't want to shoot you. Listen, I don't want any trouble. I'll just get my girlfriend and we'll leave. No reason to get violent. So, that's the illusion you were talking about? Doc, what are you doing here? Did this pirate kidnap you too? Don't worry, I'll save you. What's that supposed to mean? I'm not a pirate. And I didn't kidnap anyone either. Well, that was easy. Yeah, I haven't got much time. I need to keep the Organon from blowing up Deponia. What? Why should the Organon blow up Deponia? I, uh, no, I can't tell you, uh, anymore. I'm on the track of a conspiracy of enormous proportions. I, uh, <clears throat> I can't get you involved in all this. You don't know yourself, do you? Well, that's, <laughs> that's confidential, too. All I can tell you is this. I have to find a way to wake up Goal. Well, then you come aboard the right trawler. I know a lot about brain implants. Just like me. I guess the cartridge was damaged. Hand it over for a second. Um... Just press the eject button. Hey, keep away or you'll board the pain train. Pain train? Who do you think I am? Just wanted to help you. Yeah, whatever. Uh, 
almost dropped it. Hold your horses, young man. Such a cartridge has to be handled with loving care. One scratch, and your girlfriend is nothing but organic waste. Don't worry, she's in good hands. Do you have the cartridge? Sure do. There you go. That was the complicated part, right? Stop joking and show me. Ah, yes. What's your diagnosis? Um, the battery's down? Well, in that case, there's nothing we can do. We should scrap the thing and... Wait a minute. You're just messing with me, aren't you? It's just some dust on the contact pins, that's all. Yeah, and you totally fell for it. Well, this shouldn't be a problem at all. Clean the pins and reinsert it. You mean I should dust? You sound like my ex-girlfriend. Did you scrap her, too, because her battery was down? Something like that, yeah. Exactly what I need. I wouldn't take that feather duster. I use it to clean the tanks. Oh, sounds promising enough. If you can clean a tank with it, then it must work twice as well for a measly cartridge. I know what I'm doing. This could belong to a sea chest or something. Or to the brig in the bowels of a trafficker's vessel. Oh, this bozo makes me mad. Hey, you've stolen my key. And you have kidnapped my girlfriend. Oh, she was not kidnapped. And I can put her back out into the cold if you prefer. And how are you going to do that all without a key? Not a problem. My door is always open. So, you shouldn't be wondering when things get stolen around here all the time. So, did you clean the contact pins yet? I'm... Um, hurry up! It's not good for the head if the conscience gets disconnected for too long. <laughs> Don't I... <sighs> I hope they know how to party in Elysium. There! Open! Let's get rid of the key! What have we here? A small brush, miniature bellows, a sealed pack of hand wipes. Pfft, what useless junk. I want to clean a cartridge, not refurbish a doll's house. Ah, yes. This looks much better. A steel brush and a bottle of degreaser. I'll, uh, leave the girly stuff. This is likely to do some serious cleaning. I'd rather go for something deep-fried. This is supposed to be Gold's, but her most important memory is me! me. Gold's memory is stored on it. Caution advised. Ah, oh, well, that's just a tiny speck of dust. We'll have that cleaned up in no time. Duster has dusted everything with dust. And oh, oh no, grief spot. I'll have to give it the once over. What a mess. Another grease spot? I hope it's supposed to be like this.
Blah, no good. Whoa! Even more lit? Uh oh, Lint alert! Oh no, this is beyond help. <laughs> Good thing I still have an ace up my sleeve. And those scratches could have come from anywhere. So, did you clean the contact pins yet? Yep, all clean and shiny. Very good. Show me. Just a minute. Did this have those scratches before? What? Oh, those. I noticed them before. Inconceivable how those young ladies treat their brain implants these days, isn't it? Yes. And they don't even have to eject them from their drives, either. Inconceivable. Well, a couple of scratches. They can't be too grave, can they? Talking about grave, has someone engraved his name and a little heart on there? Uh, you better give that back. It'll work just fine. Well, it has to. people too. Deponians! So it is true. Deponia is inhabited. The Organon lied to us. I have to contact Cletus. Well, uh, that's almost a good idea. <laughs> Just almost, unfortunately. Your oh-so-wonderful fiancé is in cahoots with the Organon. Cletus is... what? Ah, uh, my head. Maybe you should sit down first. But I'm already sitting. Don't worry, baby. I'll explain everything. Your implant was malfunctioning. Your fall from the Organon cruiser damaged it. The Organons pushed me off the cruiser? Well, yes. Thank junk, I could fix everything. Actually, it was me who supervised the repairs. Yeah, of course you did, Gramps. <laughs> Everyone wants a slice of acknowledgement. And now everything's all right. And now everything's all right. And now everything's all right again. Exactly. Cletus is a traitor. He's collaborating with the Organon. Of course he is. The Organon is our escort on our reconnaissance mission. Yes, uh, of course, but somehow Ulysses has convinced him to falsify his report. He'll advise the Council of the Elders to blow up Deponia. Despite the planet being inhabited, the monster... Exactly! I saved you. I can hardly remember anything. Not even how I saved you from the clutches of the Organon? There was this conveyor belt and hey you were there too you were operating those levers or how i nursed you back to health i, I remember a, a stinging taste on my tongue and how i carried you halfway around the planet wait a minute wasn't there a crane well obviously you don't remember anything be that as it may you can thank me later the organon wants to destroy Deponia. I know that. That's why Cletus and I came here, to see if Deponia was really uninhabited. But people do live here, and Ulysses wants to hide the fact, so that he can blow up Deponia anyway. We must stop him at all costs. Uh, I agree. 
You've been kidnapped by a pirate. How often do I have to repeat myself? I'm a garbage dealer. I just wanted to help. Don't worry. I'll keep an eye on him. He won't hurt you. Of course I won't. Why would I do that? You see? I'm protecting you. Enough talking. We have to prevent the Organon from destroying Deponia. It'd be best if you took me along to Elysium. Then we could tell your people the truth, and everything will be fine, right? Right. Uh, for real? You're taking me along? To Elysium? Why wouldn't I? All we need is a perfect plan. Huh. <laughs> well, you're talking to the right man. Perfect plans are my specialty. Okay, shoot. We should set a trap for Argus. Preferably, we'll dig a pit first, and then we'll camouflage it with some mud, and then we'll sound the alarm. And while you sit on the adjacent hill, dressed as a giraffe... Wouldn't it be easier to pass you off as Cletus? You bear a striking resemblance to him. Well, I don't know. My body is much better toned. We'll overpower him and go back to Elysium together. Oh, that could work. It's a good thing I thought of that. And what about us? Oh, you... Don't worry. When Elysium is informed that there's still life on Deponia, they'll call the demolition off. Yeah, and we'll be on Elysium. We'd be heroes. And everybody will be happy. Exactly. Well, what are we waiting for? Searching for a Deponian male and a tall Elysian female. We found their traces, so we know that they must still be nearby. If you find them, arrest them at once. The Elysian must not be eliminated. The Deponian, on the other hand, may. Hey, did you hear that? Yeah, I guess I'm too much of a threat to them. Why? Is he too much of a threat to us? No, don't worry. He's just in our way. Hey. Get to work, men. There must be someone in the compound. Keep an eye on that gate. Don't let them escape. They obviously have no idea who they're dealing with. Stay down. I'll show them the meaning of he's just in our way. Go get him, Tiger. Yeah, that would really be super cool. But if I go for a swim, the guards will see me. And I don't have the equipment for diving. I hope Gold is watching this. This is something that I'll only do once. Pretty miserable. Yes, it did. Well, I don't think we need to be frightened of an animal that makes sounds like that. It's probably physically challenged. <laughs> Crap. As long as the top is down, I can't make out anything in here. I'll save my telekinetic. I'll save my telekinetic. I'll save my. my help.
Nah. I'll save my. something big. Mm. A cow! A cow must be entangled in this pile of junk! So it would seem. Shh, stupid animal. Whew, it's a good thing I'm always thinking on my feet. Don't <laughs> no, forget it, there's nothing there. Two zero seventeen. Whew, damn critter. What is that? Don't forget it, there's nothing there. Now I hear it. Hello? Hello, you're paranoid. Whew, damn critter. Finally, I can get over there without it squeaking. Forget it, there's nothing. Now I hear it. Hello? Hello, who's there? You're paranoid too. Bad is my second name, babe. Stop calling me that. Oh, come on. We need to hurry. Stop. Who goes there? It's me, Cletus, accompanied by my charming fiancé, Go. Finally, I was afraid she'd already eloped with that disgusting deponium. What a bizarre thought. Oh, contraire, Buttercup. Don't be afraid to admit that you did cast a covetous eye on that, <laughs> Rufus. Very understandable. To me, he seemed like a dashing daredevil. On the contrary, honey bunny. He was nothing more than a self-centered fool. That's enough! You two will have enough time to frolic once we've returned to Elysium. 
Oh yeah, finally, final, um, fi 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 final preparations for our return have been made. Very well. Now, I need to talk to you in private, Ambassador. Uh, uh of, of course. Why don't you scuttle on ahead, darling? Me and the bailiff have urgent matters to discuss. <laughs> But, but... Shoo shoo, sugar. <laughs> if you insist. <laughs> so we'll see each other in a short while then. Toodaloo. Have you lost your mind completely? I thought we had an agreement. The memories of Ms. Gold must be deleted. And we need the Ascension Codes. Don't panic. I'm working on it. I'll swap the cartridges and uh, leave the original on the platform. That, that, that should make everyone happy, right? Yes, everyone except for the Deponians. <laughs> <laughs> if you try anything funny, I'll personally decapitate you with a rusty knife. <laughs> 